Hello, and welcome to Delta Tech's ABSS video tutorial series. In this video, we will be guiding you through the process of creating new user IDs in ABSS. This tutorial applies to ABSS Accounting and ABSS Premier. Yes, you can create additional user IDs in ABSS Accounting. But, unlike in Premier Multi-User, with Accounting, only one user can access a file at one time. To create user IDs, open your company file and sign in with the administrator ID. Do note that you can only create user IDs when you log in to ABSS using the administrator ID. With Premier, you can select either multi or single user file access. However, to create user accounts in Premier, there must be no other users accessing the file. If you try to create or modify user accounts while other users are logged in, you will receive a message asking you to try when no other users are logged in. When you have opened your file, click on Setup from the menu at the top, then click on Preferences. In the Preferences window, select the Security tab. Then click on the User IDs button at the bottom left. In the User Access window, click on New to create a user account. Key in the new user's ID. You can also set a password for this user. Key in the password twice. Click OK to save the user. You will see the new user in the column at the left. To edit a user, first select the user, then click on Edit. To delete, select the user, click on Delete. However, if the user has created transactions, then you will not be able to delete the ID. In that case, you can set the user ID to inactive to prevent the user from accessing the file. To do that, select the user, then click Edit. In the Edit User Access window, select the inactive option, then click OK. When a user account has been set to inactive, the user will not be able to sign on. By default, a new user will be able to access all the features that an ordinary user has rights to. You can restrict a user's access by entire modules or by selected functions within a module. For example, to restrict access to the banking module, first select the user, then in the section on the right, click in not allowed against the module name. An X will appear against all the functions related to banking. The user will not be able to access any of the functions related to banking. When you disallow access to a module or function, the user will not be able to access it. On the other hand, if you just want to lock out one or more functions, then click against the function itself. Click OK to save your changes. That's it for creating users in ABSS Accounting and ABSS Premier. We hope you found this tutorial helpful. Please do remember to subscribe to our channel and give this video a like.